All right, this is Young Link Jr. So for stimulus check update, checks are coming to these states. Now, it appears improbable that now fourth stimulus checks will arrive to individuals from the federal government. Now, but states are doing their utmost to make sure the stimulus money is distributed with states giving over $200 billion to spend towards ensuring economic recovery from the COVID-19 pandemic. All right, so the stimulus checks news, this is stimulus updated list. Uh, according to the home um, market.com, it says with December 31st set as the deadline to distribute the money, some have already started to dish them out where they're most needed. The below states have started and residents therein might well qualify to pocket some stimulus money. So let's start with California is on the list. California and the Golden State stimulus. California are the only state that has sent a stimulus check from their own money as the state has a budget surplus due to their tax system. So residents earning between $30,000 to $75,000 a year are entitled to $500 to $600 as well as to $500 to be paid to households with dependent children. Colorado, people who receive at least one unemployment payment between March 15, 2020 and October 24, 2020 will receive $375. State of Maryland, all states and local taxes on unemployment benefits have been repealed and stimulus payments of $500 for families and $300 for individuals who file for the earned income tax credit were also passed in the legislation. New Mexico, the state's program have plans to distribute $5 million to residents who didn't qualify for the federal payments. Oh, that's interesting. So Florida stimulus checks. Uh, most teachers and administrators were allocated a thousand dollar payment, um, though things are still in development. Georgia on uh, stimulus. Georgia plan is generous and full time teachers and administrators will pocket a thousand dollars while part time teachers will take five hundred dollars. Pre-K educators will also likely have payments to, um, to claim. Michigan. Michigan has sent five hundred dollars hazard pay bonuses to their teachers. Tennessee checks of a thousand dollars will be sent to teachers labeled as hazard pay bonuses and part-time teachers will get five hundred dollars state of Texas I think that's the last one as of now um, nothing statewide has been confirmed but Fourth Worth and Arlington will increase the pay of district employees by four percent um, Denton and the Mansfield will increase pay by two percent while Denton employees will also be given a bonus of five hundred dollars in Irving a two thousand dollar payment will be given to staff who return to classroom in September so it looks like um, it's, it's more like a generous thing I guess it's gonna be a little bit different I guess um, when the federal government distributing like fourteen hundred dollars, twelve hundred dollars, you know, to each and every single you know person, um, that qualifies, you know, especially federal employees. But I mean, some of these different states, uh, regular by the governors and stuff, they may, um, you know, uh, like I said, they're giving out like five hundred dollars to like teachers and stuff and administrative workers. And I mean, I think that's cool. As we people are still recovering uh, from the pandemic, uh, I will say this to the economy. I mean, you know, people was, you know, even though they lost their jobs, some people actually had the opportunity to work from home. So I will say some positive stuff that happened um, during the quarantine. I mean, despite that, you know, we have like I know in the state of Georgia, one point one million cases and over twenty one thousand people died. And, you know, and we got the Delta strand, which is highly contagious. So, I mean, people are catching it, which is unfortunate, but there are a lot of job opportunities. I mean, people are getting trades now. And, you know, it's really opened up the doors for a lot of individuals. But I still think that, you know, especially with the uh, eviction and stuff going on, um, people was kind of behind on their rent. They, they didn't have the luxury to, you know, really have a job to keep paying them, you know, while they were staying at home. So when unemployment runs out, you know, they still, you know, backed up with how much money they need to uh, spend and they got to take care of their family. So it's kind of good to really um, have some money dished out from the government. So I had a feeling like none of this, uh, the stimulus check was going to go away. I didn't think that was going to keep giving us 14, 20, you know, $1,200, even though they could afford it. But, um, you know, at the end of the day, I mean, it's something, you know, I mean, I do believe that teachers, administrators uh, really need this. You know, they are the ones that uh, have the keys to our to the future of our children in a way man so but that's a whole nother thing though but that's i kind of want to just talk about this man um i'm gonna have the link in the description box of the article it's from marco so this is what i get the information from so it's going on to you know some certain states and residents so you guys continue to like comment subscribe share this video tell me what you guys think uh you guys in agreement uh, with the stimulus check i want you to know your thoughts and thank you for the support like comment subscribe share all right this is john lee jr i'm out deuces